hey guys welcome back to my channel i'm going to be teaching you how to do a diy moisturizing deep conditioner for your hair so let's go you're going to need a bowl and in this video i'm going to be using cream of nature coconut milk detangling and conditioning conditioner this conditioner is really good it softens and improves the manageability of the hair we're also going to be using honey honey seals in moisture and conditions your hair strands so it serves as a humidant for our hair which is also good we're also going to be using coconut milk coconut milk is rich in proteins and can be used to strengthen your hair it's also an antibacterial property which helps fight dandruff and itchy scalp we'll also be using pure hagan oil Agon oil is really good for your hair also, it also strengthens your hair. Also repairs split ends and promotes hair growth for you. We'll also be using pure lavender oil. Lavender oil is really good. It has a lot of benefits for the hair. I use it for my hair and my hair loves it. We'll also be using Jamaican black castor oil. This one is from Sunny Hair and um, it's really good. It strengthens your hair, promotes hair growth. You know there are lots of things jamaican black castor does for you and trust me this is really good also be using extra virgin olive oil really good for the air leaves your hair soft and shiny softens your hair conditions your hair and i also added a product from Cantu. so in this bowl i have shea butter and honey with some oils i made from last week for a deep conditioner i did so all i just need to do is melt it in you can see the honey and the shea butter it's all mixed with oil so i won't be mixing so much oil let's mix up so you pour in your conditioner you want to use as much as you like or well, this is the size i think is enough for my hair so it's quite a lot i'll be adding the coconut milk in it so I like to pour a lot of coconut milk too because I like my hair really conditioned and um, coconut milk leaves my hair so soft and well conditioned so I'm going to be using it a lot that's quite a lot and um, be pouring I think the olive oil You know, you just want to mix them up. More oils. This is what it looks like after mixing it all up. I know it looks yummy, but do not try to eat this at home. So I'm just gonna wash my hair real quick with 
this shampoo i just got it it says esper air care ginger and dandruff shampoo so i'm just gonna shampoo real quick and come apply the treatment in my hair as you can see i'm sectioning my hair you want to also section your hair so you can get the product in all your hair by sectioning your hair you get to get the product in all parts of your hair i like to start from the tips of my hair which is the oldest part of my hair the ends of my hair because i get to have split ends a lot so i like to start from the tips then i go all the way to the roots I also like to detangle my hair in the process while I apply the product in. It just gives me a lot of sleep to detangle so it makes it easier. I like to put on the plastic bag of my hair before I really do the dryer. So I put it on. So I'll just let it heat this thing for about 30 to 45 minutes or rinse it off. I just rinsed it off and oh my gosh, like my hair looks so moisturized. Feels so soft, shiny, you can see it.